Hello, it's I, the one and only Raspberry Dude, back again with another video. Now, this video is going to be different than my usual David Bebby videos, but it will still be really, really cool. Today, we're going to be talking about Go Anime Punishment Day videos. Now, if you don't know what Go Anime is, it's basically this online website thing that you can use to make animations. It used to be used for schools and businesses, but now it turned to a subtype of grounded world of chaos and as for punishment days it's basically where you give someone multiple punishments in one day and they have their own difficulties from drinking totally water to literally getting shot with guns and today we're going to be ranking go animators based on how brutal their punishment day videos are and also i am not going to be ranking paper luigi 99's taiyu's ultimate punishment day video because one it is way too long and two that guy has too much hate like i'm being serious I feel like more people hate him than like him. Anyway, here are the different levels of punishments I made. Level 1 Light Punishments Punishments like drinking toilet water, I think deserve to be on the first level. Level 2 Harsh Punishments Punishments like getting slapped in the face, I think deserve to be on level 2. Level 3 Brutal Punishments Punishments like throwing bricks at somebody's head, I think deserve to be on this level. Level 4 Insane Punishments Punishments like getting a piano dropped on your head, I think deserve to be on level 4. And lastly, level 5 health punishments. Punishments like getting shot with guns, I think deserve to be on this level. So now, without further ado, let's get started with this video. Our first go animator is super cool 3456 Now, this guy doesn't post anything crazy or stupid. He's just a normal go animator that posts normal stuff. But this guy used to make Caillou gets grounded, and the video we're gonna be watching is Caillou destroys Peter Piper Pizza on Rosie's birthday and gets a punishment day. So in the video, Caillou and his family go to Peter Piper Pizza for Rosie's birthday, but Caillou wanted to see his lord and savior, Chuck E. Cheese's. So, with range, he destroys the entire Peter Piper pizza, and he gets grounded for... So now let's move on to the punishments. The punishments are getting slapped in the face, eating a raw egg, watching three Harry Strack videos, getting kicked in the stomach, getting your head bitten, and being sent to your room forever and ever and ever. So these punishments aren't bad, they're like level 1s and 2s. And I say this because these punishments aren't really bad. Sure getting kicked in the stomach and getting your head bitten does hurt, but these punishments don't deserve level 4 and 5s. Those level punishments are way more brutal than these. So that's why I'm giving this one a level 2 punishment day, I mean a level 2 harsh punishment day. So that punishment day wasn't too bad, but these punishment days are only going to get crazier the further we go. So so prepare yourself. Our next go animator is Roku Khan the Viander. Now this guy has quite a bunch of hate, but not as much as Paper Luigi 99, so that's why I'm including him in this video. And this guy used to make Punishment Day videos, but he stopped probably due to controversial reasons. Anyway, the video we're gonna be watching is Kai use a invisible phone to cheat for the final exam and gets a punishment day. So in this video, Caillou has a history final exam he has to do, but since he doesn't like studying, he decided to use some science stuff to create a invisible to make his phone invisible so that way he can pass the exam um, and not let anybody know that he cheated. But Due to, due to security cameras, he, the, pr the teacher, found, the principal found out oh, that he cheated and contacted his dad. And Caillou gets grounded for a small, reasonable amount of time. He's only grounded for... Now, there are 13 punishments in this punishment day, and I don't feel like going through all of them. So, I created this compilation of all the punishments with music over it. Enjoy! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. 
There, that bald idiot deserved to get killed for cheat the final exam of the history. Well that's done, I even ranked all the punishments based off how brutal they are. Now there are mostly level 3s, 3 level 4s, 2 level 2s, and 1 level 5. So I give this one a level 3 brutal punishment day, or a 3.5. Now before we move on to the next go animator, there's one problem I have with this video, and that is, why did Caillou get this punishment day? I mean, I know the answer is because they cheated on his final exam for history, but I think that's a little too extreme to torture and kill him over that. And in the last video, I can understand why he got a punishment day. It's because he destroyed a pizzeria, which I think is worse than cheating on a final exam. And now this get me thinking, what would his family do if he actually commits a crime? Are they going to push him off a freaking volcano? Well, that seems really extreme. I'm pretty sure they won't do that. Am I right? <laughs> Let's move on. Our third Go animator we'll be looking at is Samser5677. Now, there isn't anything uh, funny or cool I'm going to talk about this guy. But the punishments he makes now are pretty brutal. Anyway, the video we're going to be watching is Tayu steals Boris AK-47, shoots Rosie, and gets a punishment day. So in the video, Caillou insults Rosie, and for her revenge, she destroys Caillou's entire room and leaving Caillou to get punished for insulting Rosie. And for Caillou's revenge, he shoots Rosie with an AK-47. I mean, Boris's AK-47 and now he's getting a punishment day. And since I love that compilation I did in the last video we watched, I'm gonna do it again. Really? Minecraft? Oh well, at least it's kinda like getting to play video games forever. And that's pretty much it. I give this one a level 4 insane punishment day. And there's no complaints I have with this video. And now, it's time for the last Go Animator we'll be looking at. Our fourth and final Go Animator we'll be looking at is Splatfest Kid 2024. Now look at this guy's content, he does post a lot of Splatfest content, but he does drop some Go Anime videos here and now, and the video we're going to be watching is the, is the first episode of his Dora Gets Ungrounded series, series, and it's called Dora's Insane Cinema Day. And the person that's getting the punishment day is actually not Caillou, it's Boris and Doris, not his version of Boris and Doris, they're more like his representation of Roku Collins Boris and Doris, which the characters in the video calls them abusive Boris and Doris. So that's why I'm going to be calling them. And they're actually different compared to Roku Collins version, but I'll talk about them more after we wreck the punishment day. So in the video, Dora, her siblings, and her friends are going to see the Mario movie. Meanwhile, abusive Doris and Boris are in jail after they dismembered Caillou. So they escape jail and plan the revenge on Dora. Their plan was to replace the Mario movie with a brutal punishment day video out of Dora, and it worked. But Dora and her siblings later found out. And so they got grounded for <laughs> 
Anyway, I'm going to do the Punishment Day compilation with Obsession over it because I love doing it. I should have did it on the first Punishment Day we looked at, but I don't care. I just love doing it. It's my favorite. Okay, Splatfest Kid, I know these two are supposed to be the villains of the show, but was it really necessary for you to make Dora and her siblings shoot them even before the punishment day even started? Probably yes. Well, that punishment day was really brutal to say. Now, the punishments that are used in this punishment day are kind of unique, like the garbage disposal one, even though if you do that in real life, your hand will get ripped off. I also ranked the fourth punishment a level five punishment. That's because if you remove the spike bags, you can have a possible chance of dying from the fall damage of getting pushed off a building. Well, depends on how tall the building is. And the fifth punishment is obviously a level 5 punishment because it involves guns and guns kill people. So I'm going to give this punishment day a level 4.5. But if I include the punishments before and after the punishment day, this will definitely be a level 5 hell punishment. That's right, a level 5 hell punishment. It's finally here. Now, before we wrap things up, there's something I want to talk about, and that is abusive Boris and Doris's character. Now, a couple minutes ago, I said that this version of Boris and Doris are different than their original counterparts, and that's because they act more evil. In Roku Khan's universe, when Boris and Doris are punishing Caillou, they have an angry look on their face. But in Splatfest Kids' universe, when Boris and Doris are punishing Caillou, they have an evil smile. So that proves that they're more evil than their original counterparts. Also, abusive boys and doors seem to not learn a lesson even after getting a bunch of brutal punishments, which is normal because that also applies to any type of troublemaker. They never learn a lesson no matter what punishment you give them. But there's actually something different about boys and doors. They're actually liars because in the first episode, Abusive Boris said this. We should have never abused Caleb in the first place. But in the next episode, we see him and Doris abusing Caillou. So they're basically a bunch of liars. And there's something weird about Abusive Boris. He has powers, but apparently he only uses them to get out of jail and not when he's getting a punishment day, which is will be really useful, but he just doesn't use them. Is it because he's dumb or is, does he, I, 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 I don't know. And that's pretty much everything I want to talk about them. Anyway, let's see the results of the punishment days we ranked. And that brings us to the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I spent a long time working on this video and uh, subscribe if you want. And if you want me to rank more GoAnimate Punishment Day videos, uh, leave a comment of the GoAnimator you want me to rank. And the GoAnimator has to make a Punishment Day video. Anyway, that's all, and bye. Today is your death day. First, we will cut off your testicles and nail them to the front door with a chainsaw.